Okay, so Microsoft just released a new model called Trellis 2 and with this model you can easily convert a 2D photo into a 3D asset in just a few seconds. This is really fast and yet the detail is just insane. Honestly, this is one of the best AI models for converting a photo into a 3D asset and of course, this model is free and open source which means you can download the model and you can even run it locally on your computer but you need the statistical know-how and also you need a very very powerful computer i'm talking about a computer with a gp with at least 24 gigabytes of vram so yeah that's very very expensive so instead i do recommend to actually just use the free demo that is provided by microsoft and you can use it to easily convert a photo of anything it could be a product photo it could be a project prototype and then you can uh, you know create a simulation of the item in various angles so if you are interested then let me show you how you can use this demo to create a 3d object using a photo with this ai tool now let's open a new tab and this is the link of the demo and by the way, I'm going to provide this demo link in the description down below. So this is in Hugging Face Space and I do recommend to actually create a free account because they will give you uh, 4 minutes of credits every day which is enough to generate uh, several 3D objects and I think that would be very useful if you are trying to uh, use something like this to create the 3D objects every day. So yeah, uh, let me show you the step to actually use this. now. For this demo, I will try to convert this photo of a, a pair of headphones so it looks like this. Just wait for the picture to be processed because it needs to remove the background. There you go. Now, after that, uh, you can select the resolution. In this case, if you want to get something that is so detailed, then go with this setting. But if you're, if you're okay with low resolution, then you can select this or maybe even this. And you can also play around with these numbers these settings which honestly i'm not an expert about the settings for creating a 3d object but if you're familiar with this then feel free to play around with these numbers and by the way for every image the setting the, the most optimal setting could be different so yeah i'm not going to take my chance i'll just use the default setting so when you're done with the settings and the picture just click generate and just wait for this AI model to turn uh, the photo into a 3d object as you can see i was able to acquire a gpu and now it is actually starting to turn this photo into a 3d object and we can get the result in actually less than one minute uh, that's really really fast usually AI models for converting a photo into 3D assets will take several minutes, but this one can be done in less than uh, one minute. So that's quite impressive. And there you go. So it's uh, the shape is fine, I guess. Yeah, I would say the shape is totally fine, but the color is not. Yeah. And by the way, you can select the lighting conditions to actually get a better uh, looking picture yeah it is not exactly the same in a way that uh the structure is the same but the color i don't understand why it struggle with the color because it's kind of uniform but yeah i guess that's a uh, one weakness of this model and yeah okay it looks great now if you want to refine this you want to download it to uh, maybe you want to use blender to optimize or fine-tune the look of this object you can click this extract button but right now uh, based on my testing this is still work in progress so sometimes it is not able to actually create the glb file for you to download so that's one uh weakness of this demo but i'm hoping that they'll fix this uh, issue as soon as possible so people can actually start utilizing the trellis 2 model to convert a 2d photo into 3d asset like this and by the way i actually have done several testings and this is one of them when i'm trying to turn a picture of bicycle into well 3d asset of bicycle but i got uh, this four-wheeled bicycle for some reason yeah i think it struggled a bit with the angle but if we ignore the other extra two wheels then i 
think it is very much on point it is very very close to the actual picture so yeah for a model that runs in less than uh, 30 seconds i think it is really really good so that's essentially how you can use the trellis 2 model to convert a 2d image into a 3d asset in less than one minute thanks for watching and i'll see you on my next video i wish you a great day ahead